Gilda's Club of Madison has been providing support for those who have had a diagnosis of cancer and their families and friends for free for over 10 years in Southwest Wisconsin communities. Coming up is an opportunity to support Gilda's Club through a fundraising event called Over the Edge. Joining us here on Talk Wisconsin to share the details are Susan Grisby with Gilda's Club and Renette Maurer with the Hilton Madison Monona Terrace. Thank you for joining us. Thank Morning. you for having us. What a unique event. Over the Edge is a fundraising event that is all about repelling. So mm -hmm. if you're not afraid of heights, or maybe if you are, this is a good, like you said, bucket list item. Mm -hmm. Susan, what do you have to do to propel? Do you need prior experience? You do not need any experience to come and repel. And we're going to be using the Hilton Madison Monona Terrace as our repelling site. Mm -hmm. And you are harnessed in really well. So it's a great opportunity for people to check this off their bucket list, get over their fear of heights, and just have a great day of fun. Oh my goodness. Let's talk a little bit about, now the point of course, we're, we're giving back to Gilda's Club, mm -hmm. make getting an opportunity to fundraise for an organization that has done so much mm -hmm. to help cancer survivors and those with a diagnosis in our community. So for local organizations and companies out there who want to get involved, what do they do to do mm -hmm. that? Well, we are looking for sponsorships right now, and we just need people to reach out to us if they want to give me a call at 608-828-8880. We'd love to talk to them about the different sponsorship opportunities that we have. I already have 13 people committed to Repel, yes. and um, it'd be a $25 repelling fee, and then each person needs to raise $1,000. That's excellent. She's trying to recruit me, so I'll, <laughs> I'll, I'll work on it. <laughs> oh my gosh, what a fun event. Yeah, for sure. And you know, to raise $1,000, they get the opportunity to Repel off the 14th floor of the hotel. Mm -hmm. The 14th floor. Right. So let's talk a, to Renette a little bit about the Hilton Madison Monona Terrace and mm -hmm. why you chose to get involved in this event. Oh, certainly. It's such a great opportunity. Not only Hilton, but we're owned and operated out of, out of Milwaukee Marcus Hotels and Resorts. It's one of our big core mission value statements to be connected to the community. So not only does it connect our associates, showing, showing that we are really invested in the community and wanting to give back, but it's really a lot of fun. So it's a great opportunity for some people to come downtown, um, see the Hilton, mm -hmm. go up to the 14th floor, they exit out one of the windows out of the 14th floor, wow. and harness wow. gear, and they repel down the front of the Hilton and end up in the courtyard. Wow. So friends and family can join them, they can wait at the bottom mm -hmm. and see, and it's really a great opportunity for us to be connected with such a great cause and helping people and it's just something, this is our third time being involved, mm -hmm. and so we believe very strongly in the event and very proud to support Gilda's Club also. I'm picturing guests of the hotel watching <laughs> these people scale we down do the We do let windows. the guests know <laughs> that during this time, people will be repelling down because they do, the guest yeah. rooms do face the Capitol, so oh, wow. we do let them know. To shut their blinds. Yeah. Right, and so which <laughs> way are the repellers facing then? So they actually face the hotel and go down the front, the glass front, their uh -huh. back is towards the Capitol, and then they land mm -hmm. um, right kind <laughs> of at the front doors Wild. of the hotel. You're so getting if somebody's excited. window was know. open, they could wave and encourage them to make a donation on the way down. I love it. <laughs> if you haven't reached your goal. Right, if you haven't your reached goal. your goal, sticky notes on all the windows <laughs> on the way down. Oh, that sounds they so fun. They can carry a bucket. Right, right. Yes, yes. <laughs> that's perfect. Collections on the way down. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Well, I imagine you must need volunteers for mm -hmm. such an event like this. Let's talk about we that. We will. We will need a lot of volunteers, not only for registration, but we'll need volunteers to help people put their gear on. The staff from Over the Edge will help those volunteers so, and train them and get them ready. So you don't have to have experience in this. Mm -hmm. um, we'll need people downstairs helping with crowds. We want to have family friend, family activities. So bring your kids. It's um, what is it? The farmers market Saturday. Yeah. yeah. So it's a great time just to come down and have mm -hmm. fun. Absolutely. So if they want to volunteer, just give us a call at the clubhouse. That would be great. Very good. We have about a minute left, but I want to make sure that we talk about how the funds that are raised mm -hmm. are going to be used for Gilda's Club. Right. Any of the funds that we raise for, um, from this event will go back into the clubhouse and help with all of our programming. As you mentioned, all of our services at Gilda's Club are free to members who are going through the cancer, their cancer um, process or their families. And we have all our support groups, we have social activities and events. All of those need dollars to continue services. No kidding, okay. Well, Over the Edge is a fundraising event happening on Saturday, July 20th. I encourage you to either participate or join in the fun and watch. Thank you for being here, we appreciate you. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thanks for watching Talk Wisconsin. We'll be right back with more after the break. <laughs>